Hi, I'm Christine Damco with the City of Temecula, standing in front of the Temecula Valley Entrepreneurs Exchange, and this is your Good News of the Week for April 1st, 2019. TPE2 is a city-sponsored incubator designed to nurture new businesses and entrepreneurs. In addition to the physical office space, the TP2 also offers educational workshops, industry-specific mentorship, pitch practices, and networking opportunities to deliver all the necessary tools for success. The TPE2 will play host to Temecula Business Week from April 15th through the 19th. Temecula Business Week is a free five-day event for business owners to learn tips and tricks for better business. To learn more about the TVE2, visit tve2.org. And to learn more about Temecula Business Week or to sign up, visit temeculaca.gov slash businessweek. The Murrieta Canine Trials are back. Head up to Murrieta Valley High School this Saturday, April 6th to watch Deka and Boris tackle the agility course, perform searches, and show off their obedience. The event is free, open to the public, and starts at noon. This event is sponsored by the Pause for Law Foundation, which supports the Murrieta Police Canines and our Temecula Pups as well. Recently, the foundation held a class on canine CPR, so handlers can be prepared should an emergency occur. These life-saving trainings and canine respiratory masks are exactly what the proceeds of the canine trials go towards. So have some fun and support our local police canines by attending this weekend. More information can be found at pauseforlaw.org. If you're looking to get into the Easter spirit, head down to the Promenade Mall to take photos with the Easter Bunny. The Easter Bunny will arrive in front of JCPenney this Saturday, April 6th, and will hop on out on April 20th. If you want to snag a photo with your dog or cat, stop by on Sunday, April 7th from 5 to 7 p.m. Learn more on the Promenade Temecula's Facebook or schedule your photos at bunnyfastpass.com. Join us tomorrow evening, April 2nd at 7 p.m. in front of City Hall as we kick off Autism Awareness Month and light it up blue with our Nicholas Foundation. That's it from you guys. I'll see you next week.